Are you happy for it, too? The two hearts lost to the mortal world are finally back. But... There are constantly pesky people in the way. What can be done? to me, but they are certainly not yours. It, they, and of course, me. We all belong to White Sands, to the Dream Flower. Filth Flower? What a horrible slur that tarnishes its real name. I've been waiting for this moment ever since you set foot in White Sands. So you've been deceiving us from the beginning? Deceive? We each took what we needed from each other. I needed the ash crystals held by you and the desert bandits. You needed me to help you defeat the desert bandits. It's a win-win. Now it is time for me to collect my payment. Farewell. It is time to end this ridiculous game of companionship. Remembered what I told you well. Seems like you're really into me. you simply for the ash crystals. <laughs> Still don't get it. Ever since it saved me, I knew I belonged to White Sands, to this other world. As for mankind, an identity built upon a world of lies is naturally also a lie. <sighs> I don't know. Maybe out of... amusement? Because for me, whether I want to save or kill someone, it's only a split-second decision. Betrayal? 
You think this is betrayal? No matter who you make a deal with, there's a gamble you must take, my good chief. You should have looked closely to see if I'm a good sword to use, or a double-edged sword. Moreover, my dear chief, this isn't betrayal, it's revenge. Humanity must pay the price for what they did to White Sands and the Dreamflower. Chief, remember when you promised that you would do something for me? How about this? You promised to do one thing for me, and I'll agree to this deal. I'll tell you what you need to do later. Don't be nervous. It's nothing difficult. That's right. Now it's time to make good on that promise. Leave and go back to this city. Learn to accept parting ways. Give up your pursuit of the unknown. Go now, and leave it be. Although you always want me to stay, this time, you can't use any more tricks to make me. Chief, the Stargazer summoned the Tide of Ashes. We don't have any ash crystals. We mustn't make any risky moves. Moreover... If we chase her, we have to fight these sandworms first! any further. Out of safety concerns, we should stop the pursuit and return to the V-710. I agree! Chief, it's too dangerous to keep chasing! again I don't agree either but is that an order oh all right chief please be careful we will come to your aid as soon as possible Moron. Hakate! Chief, I'll be waiting for your return. Fear is a prayer of pessimism, and the Apostles will answer that call. My dear guest, if you want this place to become heaven, your heart must become heaven first. As I said, fear has power. It attracts and drives the Apostles of Ashes. Ignorance breeds arrogance and likewise fear. Over the years, 
the Apostles of Ashes have accumulated immeasurable power from fear. They perish from the power of their own fear. to where I am. This 